All right, here we go. And this is going to be the flip against Dan Watson and Tyler Howard. When we come back, we'll see who won. Stay tuned. All right, welcome back. Tyler Howard won the flip. <clears throat> Tyler's coming in at 78.17. And you see Tyler throws the one and a quarter. And that, folks, that's right. Right there is how you do it. So Dan Watson is a single flipper. And he, his entry fee, or his entry, his entry uh, percentage is 73.17. So 5% difference. And he shows you how you, how you do it too. So this is going to be a, uh, it's going to be a good game. Put in the comments who you think is going to win. You think uh, it's a four dead? You think the, The flipper will win, or the turn shoe will win. <clears throat> Dan Watson is the underdog because he is throwing a he's throwing a flip at a less percentage. So I saw these two getting ready to battle things out. I said I had to get my cameras over there, so. Yes, Tyler can draw first blood right here. And he does. So two dead three. And this is a game to 40 points and not 40 shoes. So this can go well into the uh, 100 shoes pitched as long as they keep topping each other. So Tyler uh, left a little meat on the bones there for, for Dan. I see Dan did. That looks like it's leaning on the stake there. He could definitely knock this down. Chances are he's going to... Um, oops, ouch. <laughs> he's left that alone. He's left that sitting there. Uh, leaners don't count for two. We'll give uh, Tyler six. Or uh, Tyler three on that. Giving him six total. And I'll let you know every 10 shoes what their percentages are. <laughs> that is very nice. Oh, that's going to be two dead three for Tyler. <clears throat> Tyler's doing pretty good running, uh, <clears throat> running right out and getting nine points right off the bat. That one looks like it's on. You'll see on the left-hand screen there in the blue shirt, you see Alan Francis every now and again. Pop his head up. So that's top ringers. We're gonna see if, uh, if Dan's close enough to
Two dead, one. So Dan is on the board. So after 10 shoes, Tyler had eight out of 10 for 80% on those first, first 10 shoes, which is pretty good. That reflects in the score of being nine to, nine to one already. And Dan, Dan picked five runners for 50%. I think even if Tyler puts this one on, Dan's going to get a point. Oof. I think Dan's going to get all four of those. One and four, yep. That gives him five. Everybody knows I'm a flipper, so when I <clears throat> I ran around and see who was in the top 12, I think I probably looked at the top 20 or top 30 people, and I noticed that Dan Watson was way up there. He was uh, in the top five throwing a uh, throwing flip shoe, <clears throat> and right there he puts on two. Tyler covers the first one. Let's see if we can't get a four dead here. Nope. Right by. <clears throat> That's gonna give. It's gonna give Dan Watson another three. So Dan was one of the one of the first first professional horseshoe pitchers I saw that was throwing a flip. And uh, once I really started looking into it, I saw a couple more. <clears throat> You've seen a couple here on the. Uh, on my recordings. And one you don't see uh, much often anymore, he's uh, pitching cornhole, is Gary Bearpaw. Taylor, uh, Tyler, Tyler let uh, Dan right back into this thing here. Back to back sixes. That's a, that's a sweet shoe. Body English in there. <clears throat> Didn't need it. That was a well thrown shoe. That looked like it uh, towed off a little bit. They're going to measure that one. I can't even guess on that one. Oh, no measurement. Tyler walked off, so that might be uh, two dead three for Dan, I think. He's staying there, so that's what it's called. <clears throat> if it was a four dead, uh, Tyler would be shooting right now. So in this, in this round, that was uh, seven in a row right there from Dan and, ooh, <laughs> couldn't make it eight. De definitely did uh, seven in a row there. <clears throat> Tyler got that one 
digging in there with a biting towel. There it is. Those are, those are too tight shoes. <clears throat> We're going to move, uh, move Tyler up. And after after 20 shoes, well, that last, the last 10 was uh, 5 out of 10 for Tyler at 50%. 8 out of 10, obviously 80% for Dan. And uh, Tyler has thrown 13 ringers out of 20. For 65%, and Dan also has thrown 13 ringers for 65%. So they're at this point they're even, <clears throat> but Dan has those two extra points. And that just separates them. Got to make, got to make your, got to make your misses count. Gonna be three ringers three for Dan. Tyler's got to make these count to get back in this game. He's never likes playing catch up there. And he does. That's going to be three ringers three going back Tyler's way. And once again, the only thing to separate him is the two points that Dan got. Don't think that one's, that one's not going to make it. Yep, yeah, he, he did a perfect ringer and that shoe didn't even move, so you know he's got to be at least, at least an inch or two away. Otherwise that would have moved a little bit. Yeah, that, that shoe's not moving. Maybe, maybe even three inches away. <laughs> That one turned on him a little bit. Let's see, what, let's see what they say about that one. Yeah, he's measuring it. what they're doing right now I don't think it's on so they're they're seeing before they move it who's closer the of the two coins <clears throat> and then I'm gonna dig down and see where that tip was Close. Gotta, gotta dig him out. Ooh, that was high too. Saw that one come down. There you go. That's that's the height he wants him at. Great shoes, Dan. Um, 
anybody that knows, I think I think Tyler's actually shooting Brian Simmons' shoes. So I think Dan's got uh, six on that one. thing is he pushed his point further away. Let's see what Tyler can do. Sort of odd. He was, Tyler was nine points up and now he's nine points down. There we go. That helps. That helps his cause. Now, now he's only six back out. So after 30, well, let's do the last 10 first. Uh, Tyler shot 60% That's six, six shoes, six ringers in the last 10. And Dan in the last 10 shot seven ringers for 70%. And after 30 shoes, uh, Tyler has shot 19 ringers for 63%. And Dan has 20 ringers for 66%. So it's a real tight game. These guys are uh, going back and forth. See what happens here in the end. I think that's going to be three ringers three. Yeah, I just heard it. three ringers three for the Tyler. So he brought it within. Brought it within three. Okay, going back, I'm looking here, seeing how many four deads we have. Um, we've only had one four dead. That was the first four shoes. <laughs> got a... Get that four deads going. Here we go. This is this is a good chance right here. And there it is. <clears throat> Looks like that one uh, turned on him, but it still still looked like it's pretty pretty deep in there. So, four dead. Four dead. All right. I was just talking about four deads, and they get one. So that's the second four dead there. <clears throat> second four dead of the game. Thirty-four shoes into it. Another high one. Yeah, he'll, he'll correct it right, uh, right about four or five inches off this, off the bottom of the material. There you go. You want to stay. You want to stay within five inches of that uh, material. We covered that one. Covered that one. So the score remains the same. And that was uh, shoes 35 and 36. Three. 
These are shoes 39 and 40, so after this I will uh, give you the rundown. Very nice board day. Net four. Um, so after 40 shoes, they both shot eight for 10, 80 percent. And that keeps them one shoe away from each other. So uh, Tyler has 27 ringers for 67% and Danny has 28 ringers for 70%. Oh, that is not on. That went to the side of it. Yeah, it's open in 40. Just, just went to the right. These are big shoes for Dan right here. That's a good one. Dan can do some damage right here. Oh, that was pretty high, but it landed. Stay on. I think, I think Dan's gonna get all six of those. He'll spin his finger. There you go. That signifies six. Don't take your foot off the gas, Dan. Here we go. There we go. I don't know. He was, he was trying to get on his tippy toes to look at that sucker and see if it does. <clears throat> see if it stayed on or not. It looks like it's on by at least an inch or two. He moves it back. Let's see what happens. So both of those look questionable from this angle. Uh, he's questioning it too. Let's see. <clears throat> that one's on. He wouldn't have taken it off that quick. Two dead three, so both Tyler's were on. And Tyler gets a two dead three pack. Oh. I didn't know where Tyler's first shoe was, or his, uh, his miss, how close he is on that miss.
keep them points closer there, Dan. What did he raise his hand for? I thought he had a, well, question his uh, first ringer. Two dirty ones. And this is uh, coming up on the 50 shoe mark here. So after, after these four shoes, I'll let you know where they, uh, where they sit on the percentages. is the four dead after 50 shoes uh the last 10 shoes Tyler shot six winners and dan shot seven and after 50 shoes uh tyler is at 33 ringers 66 percent very nice six pack and dan is sitting at 35 ringers for 70 70 percent for uh, Tyler to get a... Oh! Now Tyler gets the full six. Well, that's a big change in the game. closing on him on that turn. That's going to be two dead. Three ringers, three for Dan. Two dead one. Oh, two dead three. Dan is a, just a clean ringer away from winning this match. Putting a lot of pressure on. Uh, Tyler here. Definitely needs this one to stay alive, so Tyler has to put this one on 
And if he does, he'll go two dead one. There we go. That's a do or die ringer. Very nice. That's that's thrown a double when he needs it. Good shoes, Tyler. Oh. Three ringers, three. Or two dead three. And this is coming up on the uh, 59.60 here. So after this, it'll be the rundown. So we got a first one on and then a point. So Dan can Dan can win it right here. It's a simple six pack. <laughs> Ooh. All right. So you, you see him take a nice deep breath. This is it. He's making sure that uh, his grip is is set before he throws this one. This could be for the game. And it is. What a great game. Dan with the win. And the totals were 40 shoes out of 60 for 66% for Tyler. Uh, 41 shoes for 68% for Dan Watson. Uh, Tyler scored two single points and Dan scored four single points. So that helped him too get to that 40. Well, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Take care.